Okay, I'm just gonna have a feel of your tummy now, Dan. Tell me if you're in any pain. And I'm just gonna press a little bit deeper this time. Can you take some deep breaths in and out for me now, Dan? That's great, keep going. Can you roll onto your right hand side, please? If you have still not felt the spleen, repeat this examination with the patient in the right lateral position. Take some deep breaths in and out again for me, please. Again, palpate using your right hand, starting at the umbilicus and working towards the left hypochondrium. Place your left hand behind the patient's left ribs, gently pulling the rib cage forward. And roll back onto your back. Percuss over of splenic dullness. To detect lesser degrees of kidney enlargement, place one hand behind the patient's back below the lower ribs and the other anteriorly. You sometimes need to press firmly, but take care as this may be tender. The kidney is typically belottable. Can I ask you to sit forward, please? With the patient sitting up, you can palpate the renal angles directly but take care if there is any tenderness. Let me know if it's sore. The renal angle is between the 12th rib and the lumbar vertebrae. Now I'm going to tap your back again. Let me know if it's sore. If palpation is non-tender, gentle percussion with the closed fist may elicit tenderness. Check for pitting edema over the sacrum by applying pressure for a few seconds and seeing if indentation remains. Can you lie down flat again for me, please? Per I'm going to feel the blood vessel in your tummy. I'm just going to tap on your abdomen.